Hi, I'm David Baxter. And I'm Hannah Lightsey. And welcome to Cabiras This Week. And this week we're at the Eastern Cabiras Historical Society. Got a really special exhibit about yep. the moon landing. Awesome. And we got a local connection. Going to hear all about kind of the story behind the story. Mm -hmm. And there's actually photographs that have never been published that were taken on the moon. So wow. it's, this is great. <laughs> and we're going to have a lot of other great information on today's show. So if you miss any of that information, all you got to do is go to cabarruscounty.us slash on CTW, and the info is right there. CTW takes one giant leap to the Eastern Cabarrus Historical Society located at 1100 North Main Street in Mount Pleasant to look at the sights and sounds of the lunar landing. 2019 marks the 50th anniversary of the historic Apollo 11 moon mission. On July 16, 1969, Astronauts Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, and Michael Collins lifted off from Kennedy Space Center on a journey to the moon. Visitors to the Eastern Cabarrus Historical Society can take a look at photos and memorabilia and listen to audio recordings from the Apollo 8, 10, and 11 missions. The Society is open Sundays from 2 to 5 p.m. and Mondays from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. The exhibition, Sights and Sounds of the Lunar Landing, is through September 29th and only costs $3. For more information on sights and sounds of the lunar landing at Eastern Cabarrus Historical Society, visit echsmuseum.org or call 704-436-6612. Now, Hannah, just a little later in the show, we're going to hear from Bill, and he's going to tell us that kind of local connection and the kind of behind-the-scenes story. This. Well, That'll I'm excited cool. to hear all about it. It'll be good. Okay. <laughs> now, it's fairly extraordinary as the county fair opens on Friday, September the 6th from 4 to 11 p.m. Ribbon cutting day is on Saturday, September the 7th, and there's free gate admission for everybody from 1 to 2 p.m. on that Saturday. Now, general gate admission throughout the fair is $5 for ages 6 to 11, 8 mm -hmm. for ages 12 and older, and $5 for those ages 55 and older or with military ID holders. Mm -hmm. Now, for more information on the 2019 Cabarrus County Fair, September 6th to the 14th, visit CabarrusCountyFair.com or call 704-786-7221. Get your heckling ready for the 10th <laughs> annual Buzzword Spelling Bee, Thursday, September 5th at 5.30 p.m. at Cabarrus Brewing Company. The Spelling Bee brings adults together to cheer, sneer, and jeer their way oh, to yes. Buzzword Champs. <laughs> Are you going to be there, David? Yes, I would. It's, <laughs> it is always a whole lot of fun. <laughs> Buzzword Spelling Bee is an annual fundraiser for the Cabarrus Literacy Council to bring awareness and support literacy in our community. For more information on the Buzzword Spelling Bee, September 5th at 5.30 p.m. at Cabarrus Brewing Company, just visit their Facebook page at Cabarrus Literacy. Hey, homeschoolers, do you want to join the staff at Rob Wallace Park for fall nature classes every first and third Thursday in September through November? From 11 to noon, well, got an opportunity for you. The fall session focuses on the creation and use of nature journals to record observations and experiences with native wildlife. Now, the cost is only $12, so for more information on Homeschoolers Fall 2019 series at Rob Wallace Park, visit cabarruscounty.us slash register or call 704-920-3484. Hailing from Lincolnton is Kelby Costner. He's one of country music's freshest faces. Mm -hmm. He brings his hits to the Cabarrus Arena and Event Center on Saturday, September 28th at 7 p.m. Tickets are $30 and they benefit the Cabarrus and Charlotte Professional Firefighters Associations. So it sounds like a good time and it benefits oh, good calls, right? Absolutely. Purchase your tickets on Ticketmaster.com. For more information on the Kelby Costner concert, September 28th at 7 p.m., visit CabarrusArena.com or call 704-920-3976. Now, have you read a good book lately? Well, maybe you want to talk with like-minded friends. Well, you can do that by going to the Mount Pleasant branch of the library on Wednesday, September the 4th, 6 to 6.45 p.m. for Book Buzz. Okay, Ooh. we got buzzing going on here. <laughs> now. Together, we'll learn about upcoming titles, new authors, different genres, and your favorites. Now, if you love to talk books, this is the place for you. So for more information on Book Buzz, September 4th, 6 to 6.45 p.m., the Mount Pleasant branch of the library. Just visit cabarruscounty.us slash events or call 704-920-2202. 
Did you know that monarch butterflies are crucial pollinators? Oh yes, I, they are. Yes, well unfortunately their numbers are in decline. Mm. Join the rangers at Franklis Park Saturday, September 7th from 10 to 11 a.m. for Wild Wonders Monarchs. This program explores the challenges that monarchs face and what Cabarrus County Parks are doing to help. You can enjoy a hike around the park to discover the pollinators at work mm. and then end with a butterfly craft. Oh, that's great. <laughs> for more information on Wild Wonders Day Monarchs, September 7th from 10 to 11 a.m. at Franklis Park. Visit CabarrasCounty.us slash register or call 704-920-3484. Now calling all teens, you got video games going to invade the library. Oh, wow. oh like no. a good time. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be on Monday, September the 9th from 4 to 6 p.m. at the Harrisburg branch of the library. Now, from old school to new school, there's a wide selection of video games for you to play and to discover. So it does sound like a good time. So for more information on video games, invade the library. September the 9th from 4 to 6 p.m. at the Harrisburg branch. Just visit cabarruscounty.us slash events or call 704-920-2080. Now, David, the summer's coming to an end. Do you mm, want to get wet one last time? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> get your legs pumping for paddle boat races Thursday, September 5th at 11 a.m. at Franklis Park. It's free to participate, but you must register by August 30th. Yeah. For more information on paddle boat racing September 5th at 11 a.m. at Franklis Park, visit cabarruscounty.us slash events or call 704-920-3484. Now, don't go into the SAT or the ACT cold. Don't want to do that. No, not a good idea. You got to warm up your test taking skills at the library with Ready, Set, Test Prep. That's going to be on Saturday, September the 7th, 3 to 4 p.m., Kannapolis branch of the library. Now, during this prep session, teens will learn how to use the library's free test prep resources, which will be really helpful. So for more information on Ready, Set, Test Prep, September the 7th, 3 to 4 p.m., Kannapolis Branch of the Library, visit CabarrusCounty.us slash events or call 704-920-1180. Now I know we talked about a little bit at the beginning, um, find out the behind the scenes of these photographs that you can come here and see. So Bill's going to tell us, give us that little bit behind the scenes story. We have an events committee that puts together all the different uh, programs we have through the year and, and when we got to this time of the year it came up that we need to do something uh, regarding landing on the moon and I recall uh, having some things that I thought would be uh, appropriate and uh, what you see here today is uh, my brother-in-law George Blackman who worked for NASA for seven years and he worked in the the uh, photogrammetry section, he was in charge of the acquiring and determining which cameras to use. Uh, he calculated the, the exposures, they didn't have light meters on these cameras. Uh, he taught the astronauts how to use these cameras. And so this exhibit, it represents photographs he sent me in 1969. They're literally almost 50 years old to the month. And so we thought we put them out and, uh, and added some uh, a little audio to the, our exhibit today. You can hear the actual landing on the moon and some of the excitement that took place at that particular time. Wow, I mean, that's, that's pretty amazing. You know, and the other thing, again, it's there's going to be photographs, mm -hmm. a couple of photographs here, never been published. So this is really a unique yeah, opportunity. Very. Yeah. Play a round of doubles disc golf at Rob Wallace Park before enjoying a hot dog lunch during Disc and Doggies Tournament. <laughs> Saturday, September 14th from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. at Rob Wallace Park. The cost is $25 per team with mulligan packages available to purchase at the tournament. David, do you want to sign up? Sure. <laughs> it, as long as you, you know, I'll eat the hot dogs and you okay. play the disc golf. How about that? <laughs> We're good. Prizes are, are awarded for first and second place. For more information on Disc and Doggies Tournament, September 14th from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. at Rob Wallace Park, visit cabarruscounty.us slash register or call 704-920-3484. Now the Cabarrus Arts Council welcomes the newest exhibit to the galleries, mm -hmm. Splendid and Serene. Now this exhibit explores contemporary southern landscape paintings by nine regional artists. Mm -hmm. Now you can see Splendor and Serene through October 15th Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So for more information on Splendid and Serene at the galleries, just visit CabarrusArtsCouncil.org or call 704-920-2787. Do you homeschool? 
there's a network of families in our area that do too. Mm -hmm. Get to know each other better and join other homeschool families as the Mount Pleasant branch of the library explores the arts and sciences through interactive activities. Homeschool Hive is Tuesday, September 10th from 9.30 to 10.30 a.m. For more information on Homeschool Hive, September 10th from 9.30 to 10.30 a.m. at the Mount Pleasant branch of the library, visit cabarrascounty.us slash events or call 704-920-1180. Now just a reminder that all Cabarrus County residents, due to the Labor Day holiday, the Cabarrus County Board of Commissioners work session meeting is going to take place on Wednesday, September the 4th at 4 p.m. in the Multipurpose Room at the Governmental Center. Now as always, you can watch the meeting live on Cabco TV, uh, Spectrum Cable Channel 22, or you can live stream it from CabarrasCounty.us. So for more information on the Board of Commissioners meeting, visit CabarrasCounty.us or just call 704-920-920. 2109. Now I know I've had a lot of information on today's show. Missed any of the contact info, all you got to do is go to cabarrascounty.us slash on CTW and it is right there. You can also sign up for our newsletter by going to our website www.cabarrascounty.us and just typing newsletter in the search bar and you can sign up from there. And don't forget to follow us on social media. You can go to Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram and just search at Cabarrus County. And if you have family and friends who uh, don't have Spectrum Cable, can't watch us on Channel 22, or maybe you just want to watch our shows on demand, all you got to do is go to cabarrascounty.us slash cabcotv, and you can, watch the, you can stream the channel live 24-7, or you can watch the shows on demand. I tell you, it's always cool. I mean, everybody's been talking about the lunar landing, the 50th mm -hmm. anniversary, yep. but it's really kind of cool to find out that there's kind of a local connection and there's kind of... A, you know, there are some photos here mm -hmm. that haven't been seen before. Yep, that's right. You know, from the moon. I mean, the moon, you know? <laughs> pretty big, pretty that big. Is, yes. All right. And until next time, you have a great one. See you around.